today we're in my kitchen, which is so exciting. I've been cooking a lot of courgette pasta recently, as you guys will have seen in my vlogs. So many of you guys have asked me for a recipe. It's so quick. It's super easy, it's really healthy as well, and I'm gonna show you how to make it today. So the first thing you wanna get is obviously some of these, these are courgettes. Now, I actually chop off the ends when I'm making them, and I normally do around one and a half courgettes per person, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna chop off this little end here, and on the other side as well, just on the first one, and then I'm gonna do another one too. Now this is a spiralizer. It took me quite a while to invest in one of these. They're around 30 pounds. I bought mine from Amazon. So you just kind of attach this little courgette here onto your spiralizer, secure it in on your table, and you start spiralizing. And I always like to make sure there's a bowl on the other side so that all the spiralized courgettes can just fall into that. So then you're left with all your spiralized courgettes in your bowl. So I actually like to make my own sauce, get in touch with my inner domestic goddess time. So before we steam the courgettes, we're gonna do a little tomato sauce. So you will need some olive oil, some canned tomatoes, some vegetable stock, a little tiny thing of garlic, some tomato puree, and some basil leaves as well. Sauce time begins on the hob. First thing we're gonna do is turn this on nice kind of medium-esque heat. And then I'm just gonna put one tablespoon of olive oil in the pan and just let that heat up. Then I'm gonna add this little garlic clove, just crush that and add that in. Then I'm gonna add the 400 grams of canned chopped tomatoes. Ooh. And then one tablespoon of vegetable stock powder, which I'm just gonna add in now and then one tablespoon of tomato puree, all in there. And then if you have a bit of a sweet tooth like me, you might want a little teaspoon of sugar in there as well. I'm gonna stir that up nicely. So I'm just gonna leave this for five minutes, stir it occasionally and move on to steaming my courgettes. So I'm gonna start by pouring some steaming hot water in this pan. Have this one over the top of it and then just pour my courgettes into here. I'm just gonna check on this tomato sauce, which is being normal, which is good. Okay, so it's been maybe around five minutes and the courgettes are ready. I kind of don't like them too soggy, so I wait till they look about like that. Then I'm just gonna drain them. Okay, I'm just gonna pour these courgettes into my bowl. Oh, I'm so excited to eat this, it looks so good. Now my sauce is looking so nice, it smells so good, and I'm just gonna add it to my courgettes. I'm quite a picky sauce person, so I do like to kind of add my sauce over the top and then distribute it as I like. I'm such a weird person about sauce, but I love this tomato sauce. Then to make everything all pretty, I'm just gonna add some basil leaves over the top. So I hope you guys have enjoyed my first proper cooking video and let me know if you guys try this out, what you think of it. You can always use the hashtag, it's popping around the screen now so I can follow your pictures and like them and everything, see what you guys get up to. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and let me know if there are any other recipes you fancy seeing in my kitchen. Hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.